Now, a young man from a rural village in Mpumalanga is breaking boundaries. 27-year-old Sibusiso Shabangu is producing petrol, diesel, and floor polish out of plastic and other waste materials. His main challenge now is that people are not buying his products because they don't trust them. He now dreams of getting his biofuels approved by the relevant regulatory bodies so his business can start operating. Our reporter Moeli Masilela has that story. Men with big dreams. Sibusiso Shabango quit his job as a security guard four months ago to pursue his dream of owning a fuel production company. He uses waste material to produce diesel and petrol. The production process is not an easy one. Sibusiso always needs the help of friends and family members to assemble metal containers that are used to melt the plastic materials. The process also requires high temperatures in order to be successful. That means there must always be a lot of firewood. Sibusiso's fuel was put to test on a grass cutting machine. Local government authorities are convinced it can make it to the market. We're still going to have a session uh, with our brother who will then outline to us quickly what kind of assist intervention which he, he needs from us. But basically, I, I, I know for sure that um, around September, the provincial legislature is coming to Komaz through the program of taking legislature to the people. I want to persuade them to come and visit this, this place so that they can see that there, there are young people that they are ready to create job. Sibusiso is hoping that he will receive the required assistance soon so that he can live a better life. For Newsroom Africa on Channel 405, I'm Moeli Masilela at Sibange in Pumalang.